So Pocket Option has different ways of trading, but this one that I'm showing you today is basically what I consider to be the easiest one to trade binary options, emotionsless, and more importantly, with very little risk. But in this specific video, I'm gonna continue educating you in regards to the strategy, because this is not the first video that I have in regards to the strategy, but I want you to start mastering it. So therefore, I'm gonna show you another live session where I was able to make $408 easy peasy. Hi everyone, this is Christian here on YouTube and welcome to a brand new video for the channel. Today, I wanna show you my live trading session for $400 in profit that I had with Pocket Option, which I consider to be the best Pocket Option strategy for 2023. So hey, if you're new to my channel and you're into binary options, Forex trading, crypto trading, or any type of making money online, then this channel is for you. Make sure you hit that subscribe button below and activate the notifications bell icon so that you get a notification of every new video that I upload. With that being said, let's jump into the video. Now, I know I've said a lot and sometimes we all need some sort of help or support or company when it comes to day trading. So therefore, I want to talk to you about my special and secret Cygnus group for binary options. I know some of you might be familiar with it, but if, if th this is the first time that you've ever hear that I have a signals group. Yes, I do. I have I have a binary options and a Forex signals group, but this time, let me just go ahead and talk to you about the BLW Binary Master App, which is a website that I personally created in order to help you make money with binary options. Sometimes we need that certain, uh, I don't know, uh, extra confirmation about, hey, should I enter this trade or shouldn't I enter this trade and so on. So here's the website and in the website, not only you're going to find signals from expert traders, but you're also going to find three things. You're going to find a training, a training, complete training when it comes to binary options, especially made by me with 10 different lessons where I'm going to teach you what are binary options, how to trade binary options, how to choose a broker, how to deposit and so on. So once you actually go through this training, then you're able to download an application that I've specially made for you as well that you can install into your MetaTrader 4 and make money with it. It's a signal service application. You install it and you start getting signals immediately uh, for two or three minute positions selling you, hey, buy here, sell here. It's completely amazing. You can learn more about in blwbinarymasterapp.com. And if that's not enough, we got two signal providers who are doing amazingly great. The first one is Marcel, who is by far, I think the top trader or the best binary trader that I've ever seen. Uh, he's even better than me and sending signals. And here he, he is with over 2,000 members following his signal. It's just amazing. And he actually shares his different schedules. For instance, right here, Monday, he's at 12 GMT, Tuesday and Wednesday, 13 GMT, Thursday, uh, 12, 30 GMT, and Friday, 13 GMT. He gives a different schedule every single week. And if that's not enough, we have Pablo Signals now, who is providing a, a, a signals to, again, same thing doing the analysis for you, placing the signals for you, and showing you exactly how you should be trading with these uh, specific signals. I even have some webinars, Marcel has some webinars as well, where he teaches exactly how to follow his signals and so on. So definitely in the invitations right there, not only for the signals, but also for the training and also for the application. Now, how is it that you're supposed to get into this group? Well, it's actually insanely, insanely cheap. If you actually go into the website and go to pricing, you're going to find different options in order to get it. Marcel offers a $17 mentorship that is optional, but you can actually have the monthly plan for only $49.99 a month, the six month for uh, $249.99, and the yearly plan for almost $500 for one year of signals, which is insanely cheap. And in the six month and the one year plan, you have a free mentorship with Marcel. So hopefully I can see you there making money with us. The invitation is right there, BLW Binary Master App. 
Com. All right, so I want to start this video by showing you my live positions and I want you to fully understand because uh, nowadays I'm not just randomly posting the live trades without explanation. I'm literally recording when, with my voice and telling you exactly what I'm doing. So let's go ahead and take a look at those live trades and we're going to come back for more. All right, so today we are going to be placing a few positions. Um... Today is what? March the 23rd. As a matter of fact, I'm actually looking at some positions right now to be placed. This is a, a trading zone that looks kind of, you know. Hold on. There you go. So I'm going to go with $300. Uh, the expiration is in about seven minutes, obviously, because I want the trade to expire at the same time of the candlestick. So we're going to leave this one right now uh, and we're going to try to look for another a good option that we have to enter. This one is clearly not. Uh, obviously, we're going to take a look at the payout as well. Um, we had some news today that are kind of strong news, but I believe we, we can still make it work. Um, so we're right here. This one looks good, but it's not touching yet. So I'm just going to move the pair so that I can have everything close to each other. Uh, no, this is a new change of trending. So we're not going to go into it. Uh, this one, it's kind of consolidating right here. So it could be, it could mean a change in trending. So we're not going to enter that one. Uh, this one does look better though, but you know, it does look kind of well it doesn't look that bad honestly uh, you know using this small consolidation this was the previous resistance now this is the new support line but it hasn't touched yet this is something that i actually like a lot better well not a lot better but a little bit better from uh quotex uh since you have the pending order option so i'm gonna move this pair as well to here so that there you go pretty beautiful all right, it hasn't really entered to the zone yet, but I entered the first position. Obviously, I'm gonna be waiting for better entry opportunities, and if it does enter that area, I'm gonna enter some more. I'm gonna focus just on these three pairs. Uh, I don't think I need to focus on anything else. There you go. So I have one more entry on AUD USD. Um, ah, shoot, I missed this one. Uh, it's going to be hard for me to focus on all of the pairs, you know, this one is actually uh, about to give me more entry opportunities as well. You got to be fast. I mean, obviously, right now I'm talking. So that's the reason why you probably see that I'm not like taking advantage of all the opportunities. But when you're focusing your, yourself, uh, I mean, you can have a lot more uh, better entry opportunities. There you go. This one is entering right now. All right. It's dropping a little bit. So it's giving me more entry opportunities. Uh, this one, I think, is jumping more. No, it's not jumping that much more. I mean, if I want to enter one more time, I would have waited for like this level somewhere there. Maybe lower than that, like somewhere around there, because I see the wick on this red candle. You see it right here. So with that wick, um, we're pretty much talking about maybe that was the highest point, you know. All right. It's looking good, even if we lose a few. This one, the trading zone is kind of hot. It's kind of big, you know, I would even think that the trading zone is somewhere here. Probably I drew it wrong before. So if it drops a little bit more, I'm going to have a new entry. All right. All right. Give me a new entry. This one's still dancing there. Uh, hopefully the next candle. Well, not the next candle because I'm only dependent on this candle. <laughs> 
So I believe I can just go ahead and jump into the next expiration time and have new entries. Uh, why not the same expiration time? Because there is a possibility, and in order to do that, let me just go ahead and get my pan. There is a possibility that um, the price will actually go entirely into the zone and expire inside of the zone. So that's actually kind of make it is making it risky for instance the candlestick could actually expire right here so i'm gonna aim for the next expiration time so that we are waiting for the drop right now uh though uh, everything looks to be cool like i said uh, i just need to win the majority of them i have one two three four five six seven positions placed i just need to win what three no i'm sorry seven i just need to war, uh, win like five and then I'm good to go. So uh, yeah, hopefully that makes sense uh, to you as well. Uh, it's about to expire. I'm not, I, I might not even leave the latest, uh, the last trade, because uh, it's five more minutes, but uh, take a look at this one. Again, this one is for the next expiration time, the next candlestick. Wow, that last few minutes is uh, it's getting kind of crazy, so I'm not even sure what's going to happen. We still have one more uh, minute to go, like 45 seconds, and then we're going to determine what happened there. We're going to see our results, and we're going to determine what happened there. Obviously, right now, because I'm recording, I'm just going to stop right there. But if not, I would still focus on these setups because I see them as, you know, good chances to actually win. Because the setups are good. It's probably just the expiration time, the one that is not good. All right, so 20 seconds left. What do you guys think is going to happen? Put it in the comments. If you guys enjoyed or are enjoying these sessions. And uh, don't forget to smash the like button as usual. All right, so I think the bad luck is an AUD USD. But at least for myself... I see more entry opportunities, but that's just me. Right now, let's go ahead and take a look at the previous positions. All right, we have two wins, four losses. All right, that's not good at all. So this is the moment to recover from all of these, okay? So right now, this one we actually wanted, and AUD, USD, I think we're gonna have a couple more entries. Uh, let me just go ahead and place those, because I don't wanna keep this video longer than usual, and I'm gonna come back and tell you what's up. All right, so the first uh, clip was actually doing good. I mean, uh, I recorded my voice, but the second one, unfortunately I didn't. So I'm gonna have to explain you exactly what happened here. So during the first clip, I actually, I left it with the uh, positions that I had opened and stuff. And right here, it was just by showing you my results overall. So as you can see, I was able to recover my losses that I had in the previous clip and then have profits on this second one so i didn't want to just share the clip because i don't know I, I had the microphone muted so i'm showing you right there how much uh, i was able to make in profits in regards to it so it's uh, a 1500 dollar account and i think i started with a 14 700 or something like that so this is what i was able to make uh 408 dollars i tried to recover to record everything and hopefully you basically get some value out of this recording because it was live trade okay so now now let's go ahead and talk about this strategy because I know a lot of you guys probably still have questions in regards to it, but let's go ahead and take a look at it over overall. So the first thing that you got to do is actually identify the trending. Uh, you can do that with a 200 uh, SMA, the, which is what, the one that I'm using. 
And then second of all, you need to identify what would be the levels of entry of breakouts. Well, let me just go ahead and get my pen real quick and explain what breakouts mean. So you're gonna realize that in a trending market, you're gonna have some retractions in the pairs. For instance, you're gonna realize that the price of the asset is actually coming here, then you retracts, goes back to that level, retracts, then that level and it continues to do this but in going into one direction now when this happens most of the times you're gonna see some support levels and when these support levels for instance if it's a downtrend you're gonna see breakouts on supports and if it's an uptrend you're gonna see breakouts on resistance so this is a support line and since this is a downtrend it got broken right here but it literally came back to the exact same level which now is a resistance and then started to drop one more time. You can see it here again and again and again. So the point of this specific strategy is to actually identify those breakouts and identify a trading zone where you can enter. For instance, I'm literally looking at this one right here and uh, we can take a look at this specific area. I would say this is a support line. All right, but we don't actually just draw some sort of line. No, we actually have a zone. Why? Because uh, trades are not going to be just respecting what line. I mean, they are sniper trades and that's cool. But the point is that we're waiting for the price to actually go in, goes in, going into this zone. Once it goes into that zone, then we can go ahead and place a put position. So as an example of a uh, downtrend, let me try to see if there is one for uptrend. There you go. So in an uptrend, you're gonna see something similar, but in a different direction. Here, 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 here. And you're gonna realize that there is a support, uh, a resistance that was broken, resistance, a resistance and stuff. Obviously I'm just drawing some random lines in there, but this is what we need to understand how we identify the zone. We already know that it's an uptrend, so we already know that we're gonna go for call positions, but where is it that you can actually find the level? For instance, this is a support level. This is the lowest support level, right? So this is a good entry point. It didn't touch, fine, we move it. This is the new resistance. It got broken right here, so it became a new support level right here, you see? Now it got respected, so you enter a five or 10 minute position and you win the position. That's how the strategy works. I know it's simple, but take a look at my other videos where I explain you the exact same strategy with more detail and you're gonna be good to go. Now, what are some common mistakes that a lot of people actually make with this specific strategy? Number one is that they actually enter for the wrong expiration time. So I've made that mistake before, but pretty much for lose of focus, not directly for uh, not knowing how to use the strategy. So what you need to understand is that you're gonna be trading with five minute candles. So you can decide whether you wanna go with five minute expiration or 10 minute expiration time. Now, in the previous video, which I'm gonna link somewhere in the cards, I made it super clear. I did, I, I gave you guys a super clear explanation as to what was the right way of using the expiration, which is this one right here. So you can choose an exact expiration time or you can use an exact expiration minute count. I would suggest you use the time so that your trades expire along with the candlesticks and you have way better chances to actually win. If you're using a broker that doesn't allow this, then I would probably recommend you to go with pocket option, but if you don't wanna change your broker, then something similar at least, but you're gonna have a lot more chances to actually go with it. So the uh, wrong expiration time is one. The second one is that uh, people are entering with too much money into one position. So. My biggest recommendation is that you actually enter with no more than 2% of your balance, like all together with the trade. So for instance, you have a $10,000 account that you can enter with $100, that's like 1% or something like that. So then you can have two entries on that one, but no more than that. So you can split your entries for like 0.5% of your balance and you can have four entries. Do you see my point? So trading with too much money is one, uh, another mistake. And the third mistake is actually trying to invent trading zones. Look, trading zones, I know they're hard to actually, I know they are actually hard to be found and it takes a lot of practice, but trust me, once you actually get to the practice, it's gonna be easier. But some people would actually say, hey, you know what? This is a trading zone right here. This is a trading zone 
because uh, the price went this level, then it broke, and then it got jumped and it respected here. But here's what happens. Eventually it will broke. Why? Because this is not an actual trading zone. So you have to be very specific with the trading zones. I recommend you to practice without entering trades. Just find the zones and see if the actual pay respects it. And then you're gonna have more and more practice in order to make more and more money. And now, why is it that I use pocket option? And as an example for this video, I do believe that pocket option is one of the best brokers in binary options right now in the world. It's available worldwide and it's a trusted broker. As a matter of fact, I've been using it for like about four years now. No issues with withdrawals or deposits whatsoever. And yes, I do have an affiliate link in the description of this video. And if you actually use it to create your account, I may get a small commission, but I don't recommend something that I'm not using. As you can see, I'm literally using it myself. So that's the reason why I recommend it. So if in case you guys wanna use the exact same broker again i'm gonna put the link in the description of this video so you can open your account as well hey so hopefully you enjoyed the content of this video and if you did smash the like button to support this youtube channel but more importantly if you have any questions or comments to share you can always use the comment section below and my team will be happy to reply to you thank you very much for watching this video and i'll see you on the next one